<laughs> Let me see. How are I? I shrunk. That's what Kathy said. <laughs> Kathy's a coach. And anyway, uh, I was thinking about, you know, having been in service because we're coming up on Decoration Day, Independence Day, whatever you want to call it, which is going to be next Monday, same time as Indianapolis Speedway oh race, which is next Monday. <coughs> In my uh, ARP magazine, uh, I'm going, there, you know, how many crises have you lived through? Well, depending on what you qualify, qualify as a crisis, being born was, you know, a while enough. But beyond that, you're born, and three years later, what do you got? The Depression! Oh. Boom! There we go. And for, oh, a good 13 years, it's Depression, Depression, except for Adolf over in Germany. He got things stirred up so good that the next big crisis was World War II. And it lasted from 1941 to 1945, involving both Germany, Japan, the United States, oh, everybody, and Russia. <coughs> well, in that mix, uh, you know, it always float around the edges somewhere. And, uh, and even in regard to John Bradley, who was uh, one of the people in the uh, American flag raising on Iwo Jima. No. Yeah, yeah. Iwo Jima. <coughs> he was from Antigua. And in 1956, no, 50, yeah, 56, after, just after Kathy was born, we moved to Antigua. And who was uh, running a uh, funeral home at that point was John Bradley. And we were, we, uh, I was working for Thorpe Finance at the time, I was manager for the Thorpe Finance office in Antigua. Excuse me, tea slipper on. <laughs> anyway, uh, Bob Sharon, uh, it was Sharon Motors who had Oldsmobile Cadillac. He knew I was uh, doing photo work and uh, at that point I'd taken some weddings and et cetera, et cetera. So <coughs> he came over to me and he said, Ed, uh, John Bradley's got himself a new Cadillac. He says, you want to come over and take a picture of it? He'd like to have a picture of he and his assistant standing with the Cadillac. I said, okay. So I go over and there isn't a word said about Iwo Jima. There isn't a word or any, you know, as far as John Bradley was concerned, he was the undertaker in Antigo, period. There was no publicity given to him at that point in the late 50s about part of the picture. As these guys died, and he worked out that he was the last one that uh, died, I think. So anyway, uh, in that respect, I wound up taking a picture of him and uh, his new Cadillac. I think I charged him like 15 bucks or something like that. And. You think I got a copy of it? You think I got the negative of it? No, it's gone. You know, all you can do is take my word that I did take the picture. 